Hi. So I'll try to make this short and sweet. There's an election in the States tomorrow. Uh, Rasmussen came out with a poll late this afternoon showing that uh, Republicans in a one, with a one-point lead. The stock market rallied on that news. At least that's why they say it rallied. If you look at the, uh, the polling data down below me, you'll see that uh, CNN amusingly has it a 13-point Democratic uh, favorite race. Uh, whereas the average is only uh, seven out of uh, all, all these polling points. Uh, the outrage of the day, um, New York. Uh, the city has $50 billion of debt that is acknowledged. Uh, it is known that their uh, pension plan shortfall is uh, close to $100 billion. So there's $150 billion. Uh, there's no way that could be paid back. But in addition to that, uh, it's just been reported that the uh, fund to pay for New York retiree health care, uh, which is projected to cost $103 billion, uh, only has $5 billion uh, set aside for that purpose. So add another $100 billion to New York's indebtedness, and uh, you wonder when this charade will ever end. The longer that it goes on, the more zeros get added, the more ridiculous it becomes, and the more spectacular the final debacle will be. And I'm. I'm really uh, not even, uh, uh, it's, it's almost inconceivable to imagine what, what, what can happen now that uh, these uh, responsible authorities have uh, put the very system uh, at risk. So uh, good luck to you all out there. Take care.